Okay, we've talked a lot about vocal tract shaping, and I'm not going to get into that, all the details of that here, except for to say that when we sing phrases, we shift between different vowel sounds. So I want you to go back to the start of this session that we just did, starting on the simpler things and working your way up, and use different vocal sounds, now uh, vowel sounds. Now I'm going to start on the same scale that we just ended up on, but I'm going to start on the A vowel on the bottom and the E vowel on the top because it's a little bit of a tricky transition. So A, E, A, E, A, E, A. So again, you have to find your note. A, A. Find your note first. And A, E, A. And then you're going to feel that because the vowel sound shifts, it makes it a little more tricky to find the pitch. So, Now, I want you, again, to go back. And listen to your anchor note, which is your first note, or your root note and then your target note, and be really critical of yourself and make sure that you're actually getting this. If not, go ahead and slow it down, and like I said, go back to the first exercises, and I want you to do these with different vowel sounds. You can go ooh, oh, ooh, oh, ooh, oh, ooh, oh, ooh, or oh, ooh, oh, ooh, oh, ooh, oh, or e on the bottom. E, A, E, A, E, A, E, or like we did the first time, A, E, A, E, A, E, A, and I want you to feel the relationship that you have in these, in the way that the vowels shift and change. I want you to hear the pitch relationships as they shift so that you can hear the pitch also when you're going to a different vowel sound rather than only working on the same vowel sound and getting pitch for one vowel and not going through all of the vowels, okay? Let's continue.